Update from Ukraine. Don't forget to use likes and super thanks to support us. The Ukrainian city of Bakhmut is under siege by the Russian invaders and information comes that the Russians may surrender. Mykola Malamush, the former head of the Foreign Intelligence Service of the Ukrainian army, stated that the Russians are in deplorable situation in Bakhmut. It is important to say that we will not launch a frontal attack of Bakhmut. We will conduct an operation on the flanks. This strategy is currently under development both south and north of Bakhmut. In this case, we are not only advancing but also returning to new heights. This is the enemies, it is the first element that shows that it is in a semi-siege, he said. Malamus also noted that the city was difficult to hold and the Russians could leave Bakhmut. It was stated that both howitzers and missile systems reached Bakhmut, which became a platform where the Ukrainian armed forces opened fire against racists. The Ukrainian armed forces captured a strategic line near Bakhmut and made significant advances on the southern flank. The Ukrainian defense forces achieved serious success in the direction of Bakhmut. Ukrainian land forces commander Alexander Sirsky confirmed these achievements and stated that the counterattack in the south was an important turning point. The minefields, where the Russians filled almost every meter of the ground with explosives as they prepared the defensive line, were one of the most serious obstacles to the Ukrainian counteroffensive. However, it was stated that the armed forces of Ukraine filmed a minefield crossing. The information that Ukrainian forces counterattacked to liberate Bakhmut and that the Russians are likely to lose the city indicates that Ukraine has made significant progress in the war. The people of Ukraine continue their struggle to defend their lands with a strong and determined manner. Don't forget to subscribe for reliable news.